guys so today I'm going to um, update you with my project uh, pan um, series or it never became Siri because I only posted once and this is my second time so I um, the start of the year I was really eager to finish up my products but it's not as easy uh, as I thought it would be because I'm panning especially eyeshadows and blushes are all almost impossible if you have a lot so I'm not I I do have a lot for a normal person that's why it's really hard to pan anything in my collection even lipsticks um, I think easier for me it's easier for me with primers because I only have one or two and foundations I only buy normally when it's almost finished so yeah i think uh, most of the products that i i intended to finish up this year was not that successful but i still want to share to all of you my my progress uh, with the products that i intend to finish up or at least pan this year so this is my 10th update i first posted it february so yeah we will see how i how well or not so well i i did with my project plan so i will look in my phone um the first the first is the tart toasted palette so, i think i will post uh, pictures from I think I think I took a first picture not February I think a few months after and then now I see that there's not so much difference because normally eyeshadow I don't use that much so when I look at it now it's a bit there's like a shade uh, latte and the cashmere the tart um, writing is already gone so I used that mostly than other ones but now I re I re I just learned um, smoky eyeshadow, so I'm trying to use this because I learned, and I also used it today, and it's really blended so seamlessly. It's really amazing how it blends compared to the other palettes that I have. So surely I would use this more because it blends wonderfully. So yeah, I think this is all already. I think this is two years already with me but it still blends good so I will continue using it till I feel like it will not um, it's not good anymore but so far so good and yeah I'm I'm a bit sad that I didn't use this much but yeah I'm trying my best to use up most of my palettes and this is included so that's my first update on this one the next one is the next one is the Trissy Recipe Multicolor Palette in Overtake. And, and I'm happy to let you know that I hit a pan of one of the shades. So the first um, shade in the left side. So this, I usually use this for as a base. That's why this is the most used um shade but i also below that shade i also see progress and the third shade on the right uh the the upper the upper part is also i see like a lot of dent so i'm happy with the progress of this because i've at least i've hit a pun on one of the shadow and i use this a lot uh, for traveling and mostly this is the shades that i go for i love the shimmers of this i love the quality of tracy so i'm planning to get the other the latest one with like pink more pink tones but i'm not quite sure but yeah this is i'm happy to say that i hit a pan of it i will continue um using it and i hope i will pan a lot of this and hopefully finish everything up. we will see and the next one is the benefit hula mat bronzer so this is also one of the successful ones so if you see my progress in the picture i will show you that i've hit a lot of it like i think two months or three months i will finish this this is really not the shade that i like but i just want to use it up because i paid so much for it because benefit are really is high end brand and yeah i'm i'm glad that even if i don't like it that much actually i'm 
starting to like it because I use this every day because I'm really de determined to um, finish this up so yeah it's at first I thought it doesn't suit my skin tone but now I feel like it's okay it's not too orange I felt like when I first used it, it was too orange for me but yeah now I really like it so but I will not repurchase it because I've I've um, I have some of other bronzers that I like more so yeah that's my progress with the um, hula bronzer so at least I have two successful um, um, project or like product that I used and the next one is I just follow the order in the video that I made uh, so the physicians formula muru muru butter blush nudes so unfortunately I didn't use this much so I don't think I've had I have progress to it so I think this should should still be okay I think I will give this away because I don't really reach for it nowadays I'm not sure if because I'd never reach for it so I don't think I will ever reach for it so I think I will give it away I think it's still good yeah I think they can still use it so yeah this is sadly a uh, not successful one and I will declutter it next one is the Trissy E uh, face blush in rose beach so this I think I see a bit of progress because um, I already see like the shape or the mold of the pan I did try to use this mu as much as I can but nowadays I don't reach for it but I will try to still continue using it and hopefully I will reach the pan of this next year so we shall see it's really a pretty shade as well and the next one is the essence mosaic blush in natural beauty so with this as well I don't see a lot of um, progress I did try to use it up there was like a moment that I really loved this and I used this a lot but now I have so many blush I don't reach for it anymore so I would declutter this because I never reach for it so yeah that is my essence blush and the next is the MAC lipstick in Mer. so I have a note here I don't know if you see that that I lined my progress so the first time I uh, measured them so it was here and then a few months later it's here and now it's a bit below this but not that much so I don't know what happened because I know I, I because I don't like this color anymore I I stopped using it so if you don't see yeah it's a bit hard when you're yeah it's not so much progress like really a little bit down because I did stop using it because I don't like it anymore I might still try to use it but yeah this shade is not really my thing anymore but yeah at least I did it was I did have a good progress because it was a bit long before but yeah so yeah a bit success with this and the next one is the hmm. I for I think I didn't mention this I I have the Trissy E matte lipstick in warm and sweet so this is also the progress the second one if you see that so I I also have a good progress now it's not that much but I I did use this a lot so it's a bit weird for me because I think because I normally use this part more than this like the end part I measure the end part so you don't see a progress but I know I use this a lot so wait. so that's also the progress till now so I'm happy with that so I will still continue using it because I love this shade and I have the PPA L3 rose color like eyeliner I throw it away because it was so dry already and yeah it's not good anymore and this was the yeah I only have one progress like the first one at them but I haven't re measured it so it's sad and the last ones are but I did love that color that was if I could rebuy it I would rebuy it but I don't use eyeliner that much I only need like brown ones so 
I don't think I need colors maybe in the future and the last ones are the Bibia Airy Ink Velvet in I know Bibia the what is the um the Pera Pera Airy Ink Velvet in shades six and eight this is so old already I think I reviewed this hmm, two years ago so I did try to use this in the summer I need to smell it I should have measured it like a lot of people like have a tiny um, measuring um, instrument I don't know how you call that anymore but like when you weigh food and I should have done that because you cannot just measure it like this you don't see any difference but I think because this is two years already it's starting to smell weird I think I would just throw this I can't give this when it's too old I will check when did I review it but if it's already two years I need to throw this away I don't think this would be still good in the summertime so I just checked it I reviewed it July 2018 so it's more than a year so I think it's time to throw it and I don't want to risk it using it or giving it away because it's that old and normally liquid tints and lipstick should not be kept more than a year because of the bacteria and so things like that and yeah their lifespan is like lesser than the lipsticks because of its it is liquid so yeah those are my updates for my project band series so i realized after this that it's not easy to do it i will try my best with some lipsticks but too many i i don't i still consider consider this not that much um products to do for project band but it's still hard especially especially blush i don't think any of my blush i will hit upon anytime soon even after two years so i don't think i should really concentrate on that i will try to um declutter most of the blush that i don't use so i can concentrate concentrate more with the blushers that I do use and give away that blush that I don't really use anymore so they don't sit here and be expired so yeah I will definitely um, I am already planning to do a declutter series after this probably next week I'm not sure yet but yeah um, I'm happy some I did hit upon and I will surely finish it next year but yeah the rest I'm a bit sad because there's no really progress it's that's really the problem when you have too much I think I have too many blushers and eyeshadows to hit upon to any any of it so yeah normally I'm successful with bronzers foundations cushion foundations eyeliners eyebrow pencils that are easily um uh, I can finish the, them up and mascara also as well but the rest I think powder product is really hard to to do I hope I will also finish my cream uh, cream products because they also don't last that long compared to like powder ones so yeah I think I'm not sure if I will continue project planning next year but I will try my best to finish most of my products if not um, yeah like I will concentrate more the older ones than the newer ones we will see how it goes but I would definitely not hopefully will not add more to my collection so I can finish everything up because I'm planning to change my buying uh, habits for next year and the years to come so yeah I hope this video was helpful for you and thank you for watching and I hope I see you in my next one bye <music>